Hey guys, welcome back to my video. So, I am very sorry if you guys hear rain. It's raining outside. Um, so, yeah, I'm really sorry. So, today I'm going to be doing the Halloween theme cage for the first ever time. I never did a Halloween theme cage when I had hamsters. So, fin finally I'm doing a Halloween theme cage. And it's raining, and Halloween is in like six days. So, like, I think, or seven six no five days i'm not too sure but besides that let's get on with the halloween theme cage so the first cage i'm gonna start with is max so the shaving that i'm using is wood shaving um, well, hamster bedding. Aspen got more, um, softer and, like, more whiter. Like, in camera, you can't really see it, but the big bag did, and I got the big bag because, yeah, and also, I couldn't find Halloween bedding, um, so I kind of got a little bit sad, but Aspen will still work. The first thing I have is the wheel. This is an 8-inch wheel. He sleeps over there sometimes, so this is a teal one. This is the Living World one. Then I have an orange cup. Um, this is from Dollar Tree. I like getting Dollar Tree things for like um, eating cages because they have a lot of good things that can be used for hamsters. Next thing I got is his water bottle. Um, this is just from the Living World brand too. And then I have his food dish. I have to refill it. And he ate it all. Okay, I need to refill it. Then right here I have a bendy bridge. So I kind of put it right here. He actually, I put like some... Um, I don't know, like bird, um, like some treats there so he can eat it. Um, then I have the skeleton cup right here. I got it from Dollar Tree too. I have his two toys. I know he puts two toys under his bedding. Like he literally, I just did this like two days ago and he already kind of ruined it a little bit. Then I have this um, trick or treat little bucket thing and he likes going here sometimes. I thought he will actually sleep in here, but he doesn't. Then I have this like little house thing. Um, I kind of put it. I put it right there because it all will look really nice. And then I have this. Um, I forgot what it's called. It's like this monster thing. I put it up on the screen. I keep forgetting all the monsters, Halloween stuff. But I put that cup and I got them from Family Doll. You can also get that from Dollar Tree. Um, they have both places. So yeah. And Max really really likes it. So I'm gonna leave him alone. That is Max's Halloween theme cage. What I'm gonna do is snowballs. I'm using the same wood shaving. So the first thing I have is like this skeleton little glass cup. He puts his treats in here all the time, especially his wheel worms. It was like a little bit dirty um yesterday, and like I was like looking through it to see what he had in here, and he had wheel worms. So. I'm really happy that he's using something. Snowball is doing pretty good. He's actually pretty tamed already, so I'm really happy about that. But besides that, the next thing I have is the wheel. The wheel is dirty, as you guys can see. He pees on it all the time. Then I have the KT um, little igloo. He sleeps in here. He actually likes this igloo better than like any um, the any other houses that I put in here. But if he will sleep in one house, it has to be in this exact corner. He is not going to sleep anywhere else. If he is, then it's going to be kind of strange because when I first got him, he always, this is the little corner that he literally will sleep. The next thing I have is just this little pumpkin thing. I don't know if he likes to climb in there, but I got that from Dollar Store. And it looks really, really nice in the theme cage. The next thing I have... I guess I'm going to a little bit. It's like this fall leaf. I got this from Dollar Tree. I just put his bedding there. I thought it would look kind of cute. The next thing I have is this vampire little cup. It's the same thing. I just took out the little lid thing. Um, so, yeah. He really likes that. I have the same house, but like a different design. I have this pumpkin bucket. Um, and it says, boo. Sugar will beware. Eek. Just like a Halloween freezes. Then I have this water bottle right here. 
This is from Walmart. I love their water bottle. It's like very inexpensive and it's a good water bottle for like a if um you don't have that much money to pay for it actually and a really expensive water bottle. But if I were to Walmart to get a water bottle, it'll be sometimes. I usually get it at PetSmart because PetSmart has better quality water bottle, but either ways, it's still the same thing. It's a water bottle. So if if you can drink out of it, that's perfectly fine. Then I have this little seesaw thing. I love the seesaw. So my um friend, YouTube friend, his name is Brett. You guys should go check out check out his channel, link down below. Um, he has this for his little hair me, and I just loved it so much. So I decided to get it for Snowball. Um, and Snowball really, really likes it. Then I have his food dish. As I said, I gave him food two days ago, so I need to refill it. Um, but he normally won't really eat his food that fast. If he would, he would like store it somewhere. So yeah, that is Snowballs and Max's theme cage. I hope you guys enjoy this theme cage, um, Halloween theme cage. Comment down below what other theme cage I should do. I'm thinking of doing like a Thanksgiving theme cage or something like that. I'm not too sure. But um I need to I'm gonna announce something on December on December on November. Um like the second second week of November. Um I'm gonna announce something. Um so yeah, also on my main channel, it's Valerie, I'll link it down below, I have 99 subscribers, if I get 100 subscribers, I will be doing a giveaway, I'm not too sure what type of giveaway, but you guys should go subscribe to my main channel, I'll link it down below and I'll put it up on the screen here, besides that, I'll see you guys in the next video, peace out.